one morning, Mother Pig called her son, her three sons, and said, Boys! Yes, Mother! Listen to me. Listen to what I have to say. Yes, Mother Bear. We are listening. You know your father and I love you very much. Yes, Mother Bear. We are now it is time for you to leave home and go out into the world alone. Leave home, leave home, walk alone and leave home, leave home, leave home, go into the world alone. You're not babies anymore. That's right, Mother dear. I have taught you everything I know and I hope you are ready for the world. Let me 
So, the wool huffed and he puffed, and he blew the house down, and he ate the baby pig up in one big bite. And then, and then he said... Oh, mm -hmm. that was good. <laughs> While all of this was happening, baby pig's brother was walking down the road. He too met the man selling straw. Straw for sale, straw for sale, great straw for sale. Straw for sale, straw for sale, green grass, straw for sale. Oh no. It's not for me. It's not for me. I want something. Straw for chocolate okay. straw. I'm going to, I'm going to fill my house of stick. Stronger than straw. Stronger than straw. He wants something stronger than straw. Stronger than straw. Stronger than straw. He's going to build a house. And so Brother Pig continued down the road. Soon he met a man selling sticks. Stick for there, stick for there. Good house, stick for there. Good stick, all stick. Good all stick. For there. Sticks are strong. Sticks are strong and thick. Strong. Yes, sticks are strong and thick. Strong. I'm going to build my house of stick. Stick are strong and strong. Stronger than strong. Stronger than strong. Sticks are stronger than strong. He's going to build a house of stick. Sticks. sticks are stronger than strong. Brother Pig bought the sticks and he began to build his house. He worked very hard all day. When he was when he was finished, he went inside, locked the door, lay down on the floor, and he fell asleep. Suddenly, there was a loud knock. Oh no, who's there? Oh no, who's there? Your brother. That's not my brother's voice. That's not my brother's voice. Who's there? Open the door. Let me in. Not my hair on my chin. Don't let him in. Don't let him in. Not by the hair on the chin chin chin. Oh no, it's not for me. I want some danger. Oh no, it must be the wolf. Oh no, it must be the earth. Open the door, let me in. Not by hair on my chin chin chin. Open the door, let me in. Not by hair on my chin chin chin. Then I hop and I walk and I blow a house down. The wolf puffed and he puffed, and he blew the house down, and then he ate the brother pig up in one big bite. <laughs> when all of this was finished, while all of this was happening, Big Brother Pig was walking down the road. He too met a man selling straw. Slowly and carefully, one by one, 
He built his house of bricks. Slowly and carefully, one by one. Slowly and carefully, one by one. When he was finished, he went inside, locked the door, started a big fire in the fireplace, and hung a large cooking pot over the fire to make his dinner. The water in the pot was boiling when suddenly he heard a loud knock at the door. Let me in. Not by the house.